Hello everybody, welcome back to this classic gaming Grand Prix Reverses, and here's part two of the Magical Quest. So if everyone's ready, we're gonna go on one, three, let go, two, let go, one, let go. Come on, it's a given. We gotta do that uh, almost every time. And it helps with the same character. Okay, it'll work. Beep. When it comes to killing your enemies, take out the long range first! Oh, well, can't do that. Haha! -ha. Yeah, the. Whoa! Look out! <laughs> yeah, cl climbing this area, I can't see where the enemies uh -huh. are, and I nearly died, because I've only had one hit left for this whole screen. Okay, now I think I need to save my water. Okay, I think I remember what to do here. Oh, oh not dear. get crushed. That's that's not the thing to do. <laughs> Talk on motherfucking piece of shit. Actually, I was saving there for a Donald voice at the very end, but oh well! After all, Donald's a sailor, he needs to swear like one! <laughs> Trying to duck so I don't get hit by this firewall. No pun intended, I'm sure! Now just remember, you have to switch to Turbine Mickey to be able to breathe underwater! Ah, the days of being a kid when I thought this game was hard. <laughs> right? Yep. Let's try All right, now I'm, on, now I'm on the 3-4. Okay, I'm up. Up. That didn't work. Hey, Scarecrow. Up. Oh, well, I took a hit, but it sent me in the right direction. Now to see if I went the right way here or not. Nope. I did go the right way. All right, final boss time. Oh, now you're on Emperor Pete, huh? Okay, yellow. Yay, beat the boss. Yep, so, so Sonic Geek is oh. still slightly ahead of me. A little bit. Fire Grotto, clear. Fire. Fire. Uh oh, Scarecrow, I, uh,. I'm on um, stage six, they're on stage three, so I'm definitely getting them quite well. <laughs> and hello to Sonic Geek from Scarecrow, by the way. Hello, Goofy. Gosh. Oh, gosh, I'm glad you remembered me. Oh, the world owes me a living. Be light, a little, 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 little. Then he gets hit in the head with a boulder. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Run out of magic. Game over, but that should replenish all my energies. Alright, I got the game over, but I still got the high score! Like, right... Okay, like... Right before... We started the race, I was watching someone uh, speedrun Kingdom Hearts 1. 
And where you always, where you always hear your Goofy say, "Come on!" <laughs> yep. He is actually more useful in that game than Donald is. Oh yeah, he is. There we go. Like pretty much the only thing Donald's good for is throwing out a cure now and then. And then, and you get cure yourself. Well, even then. At least okay, I, be, I, now I beat the world three boss. Woo! Good job. Well, it is staying neck and neck between me and Sonic Game right now. And like, I have a Let's Play of Kingdom Hearts 2 going, and we kind of have a running joke where it looks like, oh, oh look, Donald's dead. Alright, Silas Victory! Time for the fatality! I did have a comment over what, uh... You're gonna be just fine! Oh, over what Let's get out of here! Sonic Geek just, just, just said, but I'm not allowed to make that comment on this channel. Okay, now I'm curious. A actually, reading the text. Oh, Pluto, cut it out! That tickles! Pluto! Pluto, stop! You're gonna drive me to drill, boy! Oh, uh, well, I'm sorry, bro, but, but, uh, but, the, but it's CGGP rules forbid political related discussions. I can't do my Donald work. Oh. Right. Right oh, yep. okay. Dark, dark, dark guy not yep. being able to do the Donald work. Yes. But where the hell did go? According, according to the CGGP rule book, rule number one. On, on camera, political discussions will not be tolerated. Rule number two. There are no more rules. <laughs> rule number three. Don't talk about Fight Club. <laughs> that, that, that's irrelevant. Yeah, and Donald just took over the whole ending. And of course, nobody throws the ball to Donald. He gets ah. two lines in the game, three frames of animation, and just gets left in the dust. Poor Donald can't catch a break. Oh god, motherfucking piece of shit! Ah, can't quite do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can't, can't do it right now. <laughs> uh. my, my Donald voice is incredibly tricky to do. In fact, you might even say it's much harder to do than this voice! No, I can do this voice at the drop of a hat! It's a good thing I was not the true final boss! Otherwise, I would have just blasted Mickey all over and destroyed a beloved Disney icon for all time! <laughs> oh, hello, Kafka. I didn't do Kafka voice at all during yesterday's stream, so I had to make up for that. <laughs> Uh, of course, that's because the character I gave the uh, voice to hasn't shown up for a while. Hey, uh, what, what, what would you do if there was a banner that's, that read, Praise Kefka? <laughs> I'd frame it and put it on my wall! <laughs> yeah, no, like, no, like, uh, like an LED banner. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Can, pro can probably get one made. You never know what you can find in people selling online. You can find anything on the internet. No, there, there are two rules, three rules of the internet. One, if it exists, there's porn of it. Two, all character, all characters have gender swap versions. And rule uh, three, if it exists, there's a Toho version of it. Isn't one of the <laughs> rules you just said was supposedly the infamous rule 34? It is. Yeah, that's the, that was the first one he listed. You have rule 34, rule 69, and rule 09. No, it's rule 63. Uh, I... Ah! I mean, I don't know how. I don't know how the. I don't know much about these numbered rules, but whatever. The gender swap rule is rule sixty-three, not sixty-nine. Okay. C couldn't remember exactly. Thanks for the correction. <laughs> well, I'm not playing the game anymore, so you guys could do your own commentary. <laughs> the grappling controls in this kind of suck. Yes, they do. Like I said, Bionic Commander does much better. Yeah, I'm, well, I'm more used to, the, to, to grappling here than I am at uh, Super Metroid. Oh, there's a little da, Easter egg. I never knew those birds flew by. I know you. I saw you once upon a dream. Oh, right, that's what that song is. Yep. All right, Sleeping. so this Disney song. Sleeping Beauty is one of my favorites. I I heard that song on uh, I have it's on Disney Mania too. Mm 
Ah, I can't even go cloud gazing because all these clouds look like the, look the same. You have like three different shapes. Okay, right, yeah, I'm on four three. I'm pretty sure you're ahead of me now. Whoa, really? Okay. Ah! I, I did not expect that. Four, four is actually short, because given how often you can Hey, die, Mickey, how about you long. actually jump? Uh, uh, I'm surprised no one said, Oh, Mickey, you're so fine, you're so fine, you blow my mind. Hey, Mickey! That's too easy. <laughs> you Scarecrow, mean Scarecrow, you're going to love tonight's raid message, by the way. I'm I can see why buddy. the grappling hooks, hooks are here. Yeah, it's tricky because, of course, if you don't push in a direction, he'll shoot it diagonally. If you want to push it forward, hold forward, and push up, and the shoot up, hold up. But on the plus side, you're 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 doing fine, Gold, because there's no Mega Man X3 style dashing in this game. <laughs> oh, you're never gonna let me let that down, are you? Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, the, says the man, says the guy who calls Eggman X3 a black sheep. Well, it is. It's the least popular of the of the SNES games, at least. Oh. I was about to say, isn't it like five or seven the least, like? Uh, seven is. Yeah. Primarily because you don't have X. I heard he's just like unlockable late game. Yep. Yeah, but as for the, for the SNES trilogy, three is the one not liked as much. Yeah, Why? the other two are, the other two, because uh, the other three are on uh, PS1, but ported to GameCube. No, four, or five and six are on PS1, seven and eight are on PS2. Yeah, that's they... why we'll never be, that's why we will never be able to play, play uh, X7 and X8. Didn't they, like, just re-release, like, a collection of all the X games? They did. Mega Sp and X Legacy Collections 1 and 2. Oh, uh, I thought you were referring to, like, the Mega Man X collection on GameCube. No, oh, there, or, oh, that was, like, ten years ago or so. Now, the Legacy Collection just came out this week. Oh, then it must be for the Switch and PS4? Yep. And for whatever Microsoft system that doesn't exist this generation. <laughs> uh, uh, and there's a guy at GameStop this week who, who agreed with gotcha. me. Gosh, dang it. Because I, I, I went in to change a pre-order from the Switch version of a game to the PS4 version of a game, and he said, yeah, it's usually the people who want to switch from the Xbox One to PS4 versions. And I said, <laughs> yeah, because Xbox One doesn't exist. And <laughs> he understood why. Okay, one hit. Okay, oh, Microsoft. This time I was able to grab the egg. Yep, just hang on to the uh, raffle point when he dives through steal his eggs and kill him with his own children. Okay, well, well, in the last few attempts, I, I, I missed the opportunity to grab the egg. It, it, it's a, yeah, it takes a little bit of practice. Especially since his pattern's not consistent. Like, you never know where he's gonna pop up or when he's gonna swoop. Oh. Oh, guys, the guy's the poor man's version of Storm Eagle, I just realized that. There we go. About to stab someone. Hopefully, the programmer of the grapple mechanics in this. Yeah. And after that, the guy who programmed Antisaur into Kingdom Hearts 2. <laughs> Actually, the, the one I'd hunt down is the one who thought it was a good idea to remove the quick grinding spot in Pride Rock on Kingdom Hearts 2. Yeah. <laughs> Yep. He's changing colors, we're getting there. Stupid bee. He takes like two more hits after he turns pink. Yep, oh, okay. Yeah, I was playing uh, Final Mix on my PS4 recently. And I completely forgot where I was going with that. Go. Down. 
Yeah, stage five uh, isn't that long. It, it, it's shorter than one, two, and three. It has a bit of platforming, but you just go left to right. It's really linear. Yeah, Scarecrow. Oh, uh, Legacy Collection 1 and 2 come bundled in, in, for PS4. Yeah, the physical version, at least. Uh, for Switch, I think they're sold separately. Yes! Beat him! Alright, you got 14 minutes to beat the game. Alright, so, so I think that puts me in second right now. Right? Probably. Well, I well I just beat four three, so. Yep, you're ahead of me. Okay, so that was so yeah, so I beat Pete's Peak, so. Uh, that was okay, right, Morty. Yeah, I, I one thing I've said about the mag race of this is, X never X. Nope. The the the, the uh -huh. them calling out X for cheating. Did not become his never live it down moment. You, you think they would have would have brought it up every possible time in in the future, but nope, they didn't. Oh, well, and this is also infamous being for for having for having having a se for <sighs> for, having, for needing a second attempt. Oh, oh yeah, because X was cheating. Or maybe he was was like Michael Larson. Like they tried to disqualify him but couldn't prove he cheated. No, oh, they knew they knew it was the case because I, I have to watch it again. But they they knew he was on easy because I, I think he, he I think he yeah. brought it up saying that he was on e he was asking why he was on easy when was on normal later on or something like that. They, they mentioned in the race. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah. I did. They did. Bring him. Okay. I'm on five two by the way. Well. This is gonna be fun. Four two, or four three, four three. Yeah. What, well, when he's swooping, just hang on to one of the grapple points. Yeah, I actually want to hang on to grapple points when he's swooping. That's what I said. That's what he just said. Okay, I thought he said another word. What? You got wax in your ears, gold? Come on, you gotta listen to me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm on five three. I really gotta do this voice more often. Just insane, Mickey Mouse. Hey, oh yes, yeah, this one. This one with a half pipe there. A, a snowy half pipe. That's. Uh, I really need to make a channel banner a after my Twitter page. Just uh, Kefka, Simon Belmont, Gollum, uh, an insane Mickey Mouse, maybe an insane Mario, and just make just put what I put on my Twitter banner. We don't enjoy, we don't suffer from insanity. We enjoy every moment of it. We enjoy every moment of it. Because Simon Belmont hasn't made an appearance in quite a while, but he's absolutely not insane. After all, only the sanest of minds would wear flight goggles and a pilot jacket while fighting vampires in European medieval times. <laughs> well, it, yeah, the question is, where would it go? Of course, the, uh, my, my personal Twitch channel and YouTube channel are still technically classic games revisited and reimagined. But then again... It could probably just go on Twitch. The format on Twitter doesn't allow for a lot of characters. Oh, and of course we can't forget Skull Magadan! Yes, you thought you would be rid of me simply by... <laughs> I don't even know what the hell I'm saying here! You thought uh -huh. you'd be rid of me simply by being forgotten about! Well, that's not the case! Because I, dr I dwell in your mind and re you suffer when you least expect it! <laughs> I love this job. <laughs> Oh, no more Easter eggs, I guess. I haven't seen any more birds fly by. Just still more clouds on this DN screen. At about 10 minutes. And everyone's gone quiet. They must have lost right. a little live. Been broken no, by this just, game. No, just focusing. 
trying to beat this uh, ice skater bear. Ice skater bear. No, I think he's a walrus, actually. No, if he was a walrus, he kind of looked like that, that snowflake mountain boss from Diddy Kong Racing. Does he have tusks? He does. He's a walrus. He's a humanoid walrus Pete. So that's actually something my brother will never let me live down because we had an old Jeopardy game on one of our computers growing up and the hint was is for walrus but I got it mixed up I put what is a whale <laughs> and my, my brother would never let me live that down I was like 8 years old okay now I get it so, so he, he, he'll occasionally ask what you call a whale with tusks <laughs> Foosh. So yeah? Oh, wrong game. Swoosh. Hey Scarecrow, are you gonna stick around? And oh, no, I could probably do another FF4 rando after this. Or hope that Sonic Geek does not catch up to me. And I got second. I don't think there's any chance of that. Don't worry. Oh, you, oh, you won't catch up. Probably not. Are, Unless... you, are you still? Are you still on four three? No, I, at the boss now. Oh, that's four three. Oh, then yeah. That was a good one. <sighs> See, first comes the Wookiee yell, then the Velociraptor screams. <laughs> okay. uh, yep. Uh, it reminds me of that time, like, uh, like Thunder called a uh, Green Thorn a Velociraptor. Yep. No, that, that started the joke. Because, of course, <laughs> it happened to him and Paris a lot. And off I go. Yeah, you know, there, there are times when if someone was was prepared to tell me, but that was the joke, and I'd be like, and don't tell me, but that was the joke. I hardly find that amusing. But that was the joke. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> okay, that doesn't count because cause I, cause I didn't hear anything that, that could be the possible, quote, joke. It's like... It's like if I if I make a comment about a movie scene that I, I would say, and don't tell me it's just a movie. I know it is. But it's just a movie. But then again, you never know. Someone might say, "I'm gonna say it's just a movie." So screw you, man. <laughs> okay, that was my own fault. <laughs> no, 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 no! You didn't do anything. He's not talking about. That. Oh, okay, I get it. All right, I get it. I get the point. Yep, four three boss sucks. No kidding. Well, he, well, he may suck, but he's not the hardest boss I've ever faced. Yeah. Me neither. Not by a long shot. Yeah, I guess hard. you're him. Yeah. So no, I actually. Oh well, maybe, maybe, maybe gear him might top my entry for hardest boss I've ever faced. But actually, for for years, the hardest boss I've ever faced was uh, Boulder Geist from Super Mario Galaxy. With or without the Daredevil run? Without the Daredevil run. Girahim's not that bad, actually. Well, once you once you uh, know his attack pattern, then yes, you're right. But even uh, Zelda Dungeon acknowledged that Girahim is the hardest uh, first dungeon boss in the Zelda franchise. Well, well, he he breaks tradition I... because for the longest time the pattern has been you use the dungeon item against the boss, not against him. Right. It's, it's basically the game's way of saying, hey, you know those motion controls we're forcing on you? Get good, scrub. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Yeah. 
Yes, but yeah, but the, the tactic to gear him is you gotta fake him out uh, uh, regarding when you're allowed to attack him with your sword. Yeah, of course. That's basically what sword fighting's about. You know, that actually kind of makes me wonder if someone, like, actually tried to use the bet the beetle against Yurahim. Oh, plenty of people did. <laughs> yeah, well, the thing is, when you do fight him at Skyview Temple, you don't have the hook beetle yet. Well, you still get the beetle in the dungeon. Just... Oh. No, you have the beetle, because he's the boss of the dungeon where you get the beetle. We, we still got five minutes. You just don't get it upgraded until later. Yep. Got him! Yay! Oh, you, beat, you just beat 4-3. Yep. Finally. Okay, well... Well, 5-1 and 5-2 are pretty easy, so... So... You, just some platforming. Head right. Jump over so pits. You might, so you might end up catching up to me after all. In about four minutes. Un un uh, unless somehow I manage to beat 5-3. Well, my proposal is if both of you are at the boss on uh, time, you keep going until one of you beats him. Yeah, well... Oh. Yeah, I think this walrus just likes riding uh, on the half pipe. Uh, uh, Morty, that burp is better than sex. <laughs> Not that I know anything about that, because you never see me being mini at all! <laughs> nope, still not working. You make nope, lewd nope, comments nope. and nope, it's not showing up. That's our way of summoning him. Well, that's a trap. Don't. Yep, the sliding blocks, you can ride them. They'll start off in the direction you face. But just keep going right. There, there are a few you have to ride and use to jump over pits. But it, it's nowhere near as bad as the turbo tunnel. <laughs> so if you do see frogs on, on hover bikes, oh. you past you, you're playing the wrong game. Yeah, people at RPG Limit Break like that joke of if making so much and such reference you're playing the wrong game, so it's become a thing now. Okay, I'm not gonna bother with that. And it's almost no point in using uh, Mountaineer Mickey because he can't grapple anything. At the same time, you don't need to use anything else until the pause. I'm trying to remember what, what the differences are in difficulty. I think I, I think it's just the number of hits you start off with and the number of hits it takes to Whoa. kill an enemy, but I could be wrong on the second. But yeah, five hits is very generous in this game. Well, I think I needed to jump on that one. Yeah, worst comes to worst, jump on every one of them, and then jump off if you have to. So, how do I deal with the little bouncy plants? Jump over them. Ah. Oh, good, good, he's finally changing color, good. Got about 40 seconds to beat him, Gold. Well, well unless Sonic he catches up. Yeah, it's gonna be close. Probably not gonna happen. Just to play the next segment perfectly to get through. I'm watch a speedrun of this now, just see how quick it is. Woo! 5-3! Oh, I think you're the boss! Oh, you made it! I made it! Now the question is, how do I fight him? Blast him with magic, jump on him, and he comes towards you. Hit him in the head. Oh, and... Okay, enough. well... Well, yep. that was a... Well, that was a good attempt. A, full, a fully charged magic can hit him from the other side of the screen. Okay, so... So, okay, so... 
Now, I still know it's best to try to jump on him while he's on the half pipe, or just try to squirt at him from the opposite side. Best to blast him with fully charged magic. Well, only only use fire, Mickey, if you run out of magic. Oh, okay, so that's more like a last resort, if anything. Yep. yep. Okay. Okay, that's so now I find out what, I, what I've been doing wrong. Well, the first step is with me, you've got a problem, but then again, only Paris is really stubborn about that one. And After all, it takes a lot to get him off that plane. Oh, you know what he'll say about that? He'll say, shut up about the plane. And we just tell him it sucks to be you. <laughs> yeah, doing a character's voice and singing with that character's voice feel like two completely different things. I, I was thinking about this earlier and recall the story of Maurice LaMarche, who of course does a lot of voices in general. He did most of the celebrity voices and several on the critic and several characters in Futurama. He said the most the weirdest role he ever had to do was Saddam Hussein singing. Pardon? That, that always, yeah, that always comes to mind when <laughs> you think about singing voices. There, 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 was, there was a spoof on, on, Green, on the Green Acres in show in one episode, <laughs> starring Saddam Hussein. <laughs> Brown Acres is the place to be. I forgot the rest of it. <laughs> That was a good show. Sadly, it didn't last. And we got both the guys in focus mode! How do I dodge this guy? Uh, when he... Now, of course, you gotta jump to dodge his shots. If he's spinning on the half pipe towards you, you can just jump over him. And if your timing's good, you can bounce off his head. It's a matter of timing. Timing! TIMING! Actually, that boy's isn't too much different than the Mickey boys. As we go into our third minute in overtime, both of the remaining contestants are still fighting the fifth level boss! And got him. Woohoo! Sonic Geek, you did it! Wait, you Ooh. beat him? Yep. Okay, ne next time I get a death, we are done. Alright. I was half expecting that to happen right away. <laughs> now we're dead! Okay, we're done. <laughs> okay. Alright, so congratulations to dying, you've won the race. Um, and make sure you check out the Classic Gaming Grand Prix channel for more content. Later, folks! See ya. See you in your nightmares. Ha! <laughs>